Hi, welcome to BK Engineering. And in this video course series, we're going to try out different examples and exercises for the software Autodesk Inventor. Let's go on. Welcome back everyone. In this video, we're going to do some basic exercises in Autodesk Inventor. There are 30 basic exercises for these exercises. Please click the link in the description. Now we are going with exercise number 7. Open the Inventor. Here select the part modeling. First of all, we have to select the plane here. I am selecting the XY plane. So now I am going with the outer boundaries of our model. So I am drawing the circles, outer circles here, which having a radius of 75 mm. Yeah, I am clicking the circle here. And taking the, the radius is 75 means diameter is 150. And taking the diameter is 150. Also I am taking here another two circles on the left side which has a diameter of 50 mm and radius is 40 mm. So I am taking in another two circles here. <coughs> Giving the dimensions for these two circles it has a diameter of 50 mm and it has a radius of 40 means diameter is 80 mm. So I am giving the distance between these two circles here. The distance is 150 mm from this point to this point. And a distance of 150 mm. So now I am drawing the straight lines here. So here click on the line here. And drawing here two lines. So I am giving the distance for these lines is 20 mm. Click on dimensions here, select these lines, giving the distance of 20 mm. Also, I am giving the constraints here, I am giving the equal constraint to these two lines. So, now I am drawing a one arc here. So click on the three point arc, selecting this point and this point. So now I am giving the tangent relation to this circle and this arc. Same giving this circle and this arc. So that's it. So now I am taking some reference line here. Click on line here. this line to the construction line so so now no need to draw another arc here so simply click on mirror here select the curve and select the line click on apply so that's it we created the another arc here as well so now I am removing these lines and curves here so Click on trim here, select this curve, remove this curve. Also I am removing this curve as well. So now I have to do the mirror again, this left side part to the right side. So click on mirror here, select these, uh, select these sketches. And click on the mirror line click on apply so that's it we created the mirror of the right side 
so now again we have to trim these curves so that's it so now i am creating the inner circle here with having a diameter of 100 mm so click on circle here again give the diameter of 100 mm so that's it so click on finish sketch here so now we have to give the thickness here there is a thickness of 20 mm so click on extrude here select the sketch give the thickness of 20 mm click on ok so that's it we create we given the thickness as well so we have to give the another sketches here there is another circles here and we have to cut this circle with having a diameter of 135.6 mm so click on the sketch here I'm taking again the circle here click on circle give the diameter of the circle 135.6 mm also we have to give the another circle here which having a 100 mm diameter so that's it so now we have to cut the sketch into the 10 mm so click on finish sketch here click on extrude again here select the cut and we have to give the distance of cut 10 mm select the sketch click on ok so that's it cut this part so i like to keep an isometric view so that's it guys our model is ready there are 30 more exercises if you want to check out our whole cad models that are there in our GrabCAD. there's a link in the description go ahead and if you learn the software inventor or any other mechanical design softwares please uh, check the link in the description or contact to these numbers thank you